Meanwhile, one local Bay Area product hoping to get drafted tonight, Amani Urawariwe, a Gaither High alum and Penn State cornerback, now waiting to hear his name called tonight. Let's head out to Lutz. Brandon Baylor is live at a draft party there with Amani, and unfortunately, Brandon, he did not hear his name tonight. Yeah, John, that's right. But of course, you know, time moves on and you have the weekend to this point. I'm joined by Monty now. Of course, here behind us, you see the party still going on. Uh, a lot of high expectations head into the weekend at Imani. Why was it so important to have your family here for this opportunity? I mean, it's just a big moment, something you work your whole life for, something, you know, you prepare since you were in diapers for um, and that you dream of. And so um, it's a special moment to just have your whole family here and, you know, around you, supporting you, family and friends. And, and you see a lot of smiling faces and a lot of people saying congratulations to you into the weekend. Of course, they're seeing us on air right now. But just talk about the optimism going into the weekend. Yeah, I mean, like you said, it's a, it's a dream. It's a blessing regardless of the, whatever happens. Um, doesn't matter where you go. Um, Tom Brady, obviously, is a great example of that. A lot of people are great examples of that. So it doesn't really matter where you go. It's a matter what, what you do with it. So I'll be ready when my time comes. And you mentioned you have a chip on your shoulder. How much bigger does that chip grow at this moment? Huh? How much bigger does that chip on your shoulder grow now heading into the weekend? I mean, I don't, I don't really believe in that. I, I have a standard of how I'm going to work regardless of where, what happens to me, where, what adversity or anything like that. So I don't really see it as a chip on my shoulder. I just see it as, you know, just another day of going to work and proving people wrong like I've always done. You know, you know that moment is coming. You know, what are the emotions going to be like when you see your name across that screen? I mean, it's going to be crazy. I don't know how I'm going to feel, but at the end of the day, it's just going to be a blessing, like I said, and it's just going to be a great opportunity, a great moment. So. And like I told you off camera, of course, this weekend, I'm sure it's definitely going to happen, considering that we saw a lot of names come off the board. And John, that bowl 12 for him, no reason why that shouldn't happen this weekend. Back to you.